Safety is always top of mind on the equipment we sell here at Craftsman Utility Trailer. Unfortunately, common sense isn't always common practice in the field. So today we're going to review some of the LiftGate best practices that hopefully you can share with your team. Number one, training. Each driver should be pre-trained before operating a lift gate. Each gate comes with a manufacturer owner's manual in the back of the trailer. The driver should also be familiar with the lift gate operation and safety decals, which are located on the column of the lift gates or side walls of the trailer. Number two, the retention ramp. The 16 inch aluminum retention ramp should always be placed into the up position when product is loaded onto the lift gate. This is the number one safety feature of the lift gate that is often the most neglected in the field. Lower the gate to hip height, open the retention ramp, then lower the gate to the ground before retrieving your product. The retention ramp will stop product from falling off the gate, preventing a dangerous situation. The importance of having the retention ramp in the up position when offloading your product cannot be stressed enough. This is a must. Number three, pinch points. Be aware of the pinch points on the lift gate and keep your fingers, arms, and feet away from these areas. First pinch point is the retention ramp that we just discussed. Keep your fingers clear when opening and closing this retention ramp. The second area to be aware of is your foot positioning when raising the gate to the up position. Try and keep your feet in a comfortable position located near the controls, but away from the edge of the gate to prevent your toes from being smashed. The third and final pinch point area to be aware of is when you're opening and closing the lift gate platform. There is a reason for two hands required to open a lift gate and close a lift gate, and that is to avoid any arms, fingers from being in the way when the platform is opening and closing. Number four, eyes forward. Always have eyes facing forward when exiting the trailer with product onto the gate platform. When possible, always exit with the load in front of you and keep the product in the center of the gate platform. And last, we have number five, safety cones. Safety cone placement should be on each side of the open lift gate platform area. Always check with your company specific policy and procedures for safety cone placement and usage. Thank you for taking the time to tune in and go over some of the best practices in lift gate safety. Be sure to check out some of our other videos on what not to do when operating a gate and safety features of our epic and loader trailers. Let's stay safe out there while getting the job done.